All is well, all is well with me. Man, my name is Favorite St. Clair. And today, man, first off, I want to just tell my subscribers, man, I love y'all, man. I woke up this morning to about five more subscribers, I think four or five more subscribers. And you know what, man, that mean a lot to me, man, because I'm trying to really get my message out. And I, th I want to thank y'all for believing in me and, ch and giving me a chance, you know. And, you know, a lot of people be happy to, to get 100, 100K. I'm so happy with the little 14 I get now because I know God go grow it and God got something special for me. It's just amazing. It's just amazing, man. I thank y'all and I love y'all. But the video is next. Man I should never tell nobody. Is your goals and your ideas, right? And I fell with this so many different times because let me tell y'all something, man. There's a lot of y'all that probably got like great ideas, um, some goals. You might want to start a business. You might want to start, uh, you know, going to a certain place. You might want to start, you know, you might want to do something. There's so many, think of just some goals and ideas that you got, right? And the problem that a lot of us human beings got is when we got like this great idea and, you know, this, this great thought. And, you know, just this mastermind idea that can get us a lot of money, that can help us spiritually, whatever it is. Um, what we tend to do is we get excited. So we like to go out and tell our friends, yo, bro, I got the job. I did this or yo, bro, I started this business or um, yo, like I'm, I'm finna make this amount of money doing this, this, this and this, bro. I just want to, you know, what I'm saying like we get so excited and we can't keep that stuff in. We want to go out and tell people. But little do you know, when you're telling certain people, and this is why it's important to have real people around you. When you tell certain people your business and your goals and your ideas, one of the things that they can do is they can take your fucking ideas, right? I didn't have times where I started certain shit and I tell niggas about it. And then two, three days later, they doing the same thing I told them. I'm like, bro, you wasn't thinking about that shit. Like, you niggas wasn't thinking about doing this before I came and told y'all about it. You feel what I'm saying? Like, it's a lot of niggas like that. And these are the people that's envious and want to be just like you. So this is why it's important to watch you to fuck you around. Some of these niggas do not be your homeboy. And same for you females if y'all watching this, man. Like, a lot of these hoes don't be your homegirls. You tell they ass some shit that you starting, you might want to start a wig company or a nail line. And you tell your girls about it, and the next day, they trying to start their nail line. How the hell that work? You feel what I'm saying? And another thing, too, a reason why you shouldn't tell people your ideas and goals is because a lot of people would like to shut that shit down. This is why I stopped telling people the things that I want to do my goals and different things like that because a lot of people don't understand it a lot of people like to criticize and i just made a video telling y'all to shut the fuck up and be you um and one of the things i said in that video was how a lot of people the only thing they know how to do is judge and criticize so when they see you as a person is growing and you got these new ideas and trying to do different things the first thing that come to their mind is criticize shut you down they want you to feel like you're not good enough to do that